Online class for kids. Hello there. Welcome to another exciting episode here at Online Class for Kids. Did you ever wonder how our body works? From the tips of our fingers to the depths of our minds, our bodies are a marvel of nature's engineering. In this video, we will uncover the fascinating science and stories behind each of these remarkable body parts. Our body is made up of different parts, so get ready to be amazed because we're about to embark on an educational adventure that will leave you with a whole new appreciation for the incredible machine that is the human body. Let's get started! The organ inside our head is our brain. Our brain is the captain of our body. It controls everything in our body, from our thoughts, memory, motor skills, breathing, and many more. Another important part of our body is the heart. The heart is the muscle that pumps blood needed by our body. If you place your hand on your chest, you can feel your heartbeat. That's your heart working hard to pump blood. Amazing, right? On the other hand, the lungs are what allow us to breathe. We bring oxygen into our bodies by inhaling and expelling carbon dioxide by exhaling. This exchange of air is done in our lungs. Another body part that we have is the skeleton. The skeleton is made up of bones that protect the organs inside our body and help us move around. Did you know that an adult human has 206 bones, while a child's skeleton has more than 300 bones? Amazing, right? Working hand in hand with our bones are the muscles. Muscles cover our bones and control our movements. Our muscles move without us having to constantly think about it. For example, when we run, our muscles work together to help us move. Our skin then covers our entire body. The skin is our first line of defense against the environment. Through our skin, we can send information to the brain about the things we touch. <laughs> the stomach is another important body part that breaks down the food we eat. The digestive juices in our stomach are so acidic that it can even dissolve a nail. After the stomach breaks down our food, it passes down to our intestines. The intestines are divided into two parts, the small and large intestines. The small intestines further break down food so the body can absorb nutrients, while the large intestines absorb water and salt and are responsible for our bowel movement. Now that we have learned about the different parts of the body, we must take very good care of ourselves. Here are some ways that you can stay healthy. Eat healthy foods. Our 
body needs the proper nutrients to function well. We can get these nutrients by eating a variety of healthy foods. Make sure to eat your vegetables. Be active. Exercising regularly is very important in keeping our body healthy. Have a good night's sleep. Sleeping is good for our body. Having a well-rested sleep allows our body to recover from the day and we wake up feeling refreshed and ready for a new day. I hope you had a wonderful time learning about the different parts of our body. See you next time for another fun good learning only here at Online Class for Kids. Visit onlineclassforkids.com for more fun learning videos and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.